Lin Chiyunin versus Ryusei Amai. Li Chiyunin and Ryusei Amai are both hugely talented in their martial arts technique and their ever-growing popularity in the world of show business. Both of these extremely versatile youngsters have shown the ability for discipline and capability when it comes to fighting, and both started at an extremely young age. Lin Chiyunin's focus is being a Taekwondo and Kung Fu master, whereas Ryusei Imai concentrates on Jeet Kune Do, a hybrid philosophy of martial arts created by Bruce Lee. All of these techniques can cause serious damage to an opponent, but what would happen if these two youngsters were to come face to face in a standoff? Which technique would be the superior one, and which would win? That's what we're going to look at in this video. Keep watching to find out. Before we get into our list, remember to give us a thumbs up and a quick click on our subscribe button to get more videos like this one and support Brutal TV. Thanks! But for now, let's look at Li Chiyunin versus Ryusei Imai. Let's start with Li Chiyunin. Chiyunin was born in May 2004 in Ningbo, Shoshong, China, and is an actor and singer as well as a Taekwondo and Kung Fu master. From a very young age, he trained in Kung Fu and Taekwondo with his father, who was his mentor and a massive influence. He was not only a martial arts performer, but also dubbed a karting genius after he delivered an incredible performance at the 2012 Karting World Championship at the age of eight. This was to bring him to the attention of the media, and after appearing in several satellite TV shows, he was signed up by Ed Star Pictures' Starlight Culture Media. In 2016, he landed his first movie role in Kung Fu Boys. This was the film to expose Chiyunen's martial arts talent to the world. He continued his movie career appearing in Big Brother in 2018 and Enter the Fat Dragon in 2020, a remake of Enter the Dragon starring Bruce Lee. All of his movies highlighted his amazing athletic talent for Kung Fu and Taekwondo. Chi Yunen stands at 140 centimeters in height and is known to have one of the highest kicks in Taekwondo. In the World Taekwondo Prumse Championships, Chi Yunen achieved a gold medal in his performance against Jake Evan de Guzman in the men's freestyle individual under 17 category. In Chi Yunen's performances, there is great smoothness to his acrobatic moves. He is fast and yet elegant, being able to spin several times in mid-air before making a perfect landing. His feet have enough power to fend off more than one opponent at a time. He is a born gymnast and perfectionist in his art. A boy of many talents, Chiyunin has a very bright future ahead of him. Moving on to Ryusei Imai, the world's strongest kid. This eight-year-old martial artist is also known as the Bruce Lee Kid. Ryusei was born in 2010 in Nara, Japan. At the age of one, he began to watch Bruce Lee movies, and by the age of four, he was imitating scenes from these movies. Within one year, he had already mastered the nunchaku scene from Game of Death. So it goes without saying that his idol is Lee and the young boy's passion to be the same as him. Initially, he used to train in his home, and later at the age of five, he started his official training of Jeet Kune Do, a hybrid philosophy of martial arts created by Bruce Lee, which in Lee's words is simply the direct expression of one's feelings with a minimum of movements and energy. Despite his young age, he gets up at 6 in the morning and trains for an hour and a half every morning before going to school. When he returns, he runs for another hour and then spends another two hours working on his kicks and nunchaku routines. Not forgetting the one-finger press-ups and one-handed push-ups on his knuckles. We're about halfway through now and just a reminder to like this video and subscribe to Brutal TV for more top quality fighting videos. Now on with our fight. Ryusei was first introduced to the world three years ago when a video of him imitating his hero went viral. He soon became one of the most wanted faces around the world. 
In 2016, he was invited to the international show Little Big Shot, where he showcased his action stunt by Bruce Lee. Again in 2017, he was invited to the show where he was asked what superpower he would like to have, for which he answered of having some power like his idol, Bruce Lee. So if you could have a superpower, what would it be? Bruce Lee. He said he wants to be something like Bruce Lee. He is also the brand ambassador of One Championship. He was welcomed to the Singapore-based martial arts organization by flyweight mixed martial artist Demetrius Mighty Mouse Johnson of the United States. Not only does Ryusei imitate the movies of Lee, but he also imitates his physique with a six-pack that you wouldn't expect to see on a young boy of three foot four inches tall and weighing only 31 kilograms. Over the years of Ryusei Imaye's martial arts career, he has amassed great fortunes with massive earnings. As of 2020, the estimated net worth of Imaye is over $5 million, which is mostly derived from his social media career. Having already become a national treasure in his home country and amassing a massive social media following, the Wonder Kid is tipped to become the next Japanese star to hit the global screens. There is no doubt that both of these youngsters deserve the recognition that they have achieved and are extremely talented with great discipline in their martial art. They also both hold a great deal of passion for their art. I think it's safe to say that they both seem to admire the late, great Bruce Lee, with Ryusei going that extra mile of imitating his hero's exact moves. But which one of these talented boys would win in a fight? Well, this is a difficult one, as we have to take into account the huge difference in height and age, but without these differences, it would be a really close call. On the one hand, Lin Chiyunin has proved himself by achieving a gold in the World Taekwondo Championships. But given time, Ryusei could also achieve a gold medal in his chosen martial art. Chiyunin has been able to show off his talent to a much wider audience through the big screen. But Ryusei is well on the way to doing that as he is very talented when it comes to imitating Bruce Lee. When it comes to their chosen martial art, there is very little difference as they both practice pretty much the same moves. They also both have a tremendous amount of speed and physical agility and are blessed in their field of gymnastics. I think it's safe to say this really is an even playing field, apart from the difference in height and age, which must see Chiyunen take this one for now. Ask again in five years time and the answer might be very different. So that's it for our look at Lin Chiyunin versus Ryusei Imai. Which do you think would win? Do you agree with our view or would you like to challenge us? Please let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to Brutal TV for more top fighting videos just like this one. Thanks for watching.